Hello everybody and welcome back to the winter wonderland of Venar in which our colony is thriving in making some mind mold to drug basically everyone we know and that's part of our colony which is just absolutely amazing like we are really good people we are really good people like we we are so nice for drugging our entire com com colony that's just amazing isn't it you would do that too uh, and then we'll make them dance like puppets let them become our sex slaves to then sell to aliens who will do all sorts of weird stuff with them and we make lots of money but they can also pay us in melons so that's fine too ha huh. trading where's the trading thing again i keep forgetting what button to push and um there you go export barley Let's export some barley. I think we've got plenty of it right now. How much have, how much have we got? There is an inventory somewhere. I just need to figure out how to, how to get to it. There isn't... No, this is not it. Is it. Or can I go to the inventory from in here? Yes, I can. Uh, barley. We should have gotten all the barley. We've got plenty of barley. It's consumable right now, which is fine. But you're going to have to bring it to this place because that's what we need to do. Come on, bring it to the trade hub. The, the, I mean the trade hub and get it done. Export my fucking barley because I want to get I don't even know what I'm getting for this. Oh look at that We got we did the mind molting. We got uh, some nanites and some quinoa from that a new mission. Hi, mate Right, what do you want to do now export the mind mold? Okay, we'll get porridge I mean everyone likes a bit of porridge don't they? I don't know if they do actually that's not really up For me to say first of all we're doing the barley and after that we'll do the mind mold Okay, so we'll just keep producing the mind mold so that we have Plenty of mind mold, which will get the happiness up there, I suppose. Uh, they will probably get addicted, however, which... What the hell was that? What did that say? There was like a pop-up message that disappeared immediately afterwards again, and I'm scared now. Uh, how's the uh, nanites doing? We are... We've got plenty of iron going on. We could probably get... Can we get two iron mines on it? I think everything is running even now. I think it's fine. We're creating plenty of nanites. We don't need any more. Look at the amount of nanites that we have. Like... We started with 190 when this episode began. It's been three minutes. We've got 260. Like, the amount of energy that we are creating is absolutely ridiculous. Uh, are there any things that we'd still like to do? An energy battery. Do we already... We already have one somewhere, right? Was that in this one? Did I already place one? I'm pretty sure that I already did, didn't I? I mean, I've been playing this game on my own as well on a different map. Did I already place the energy battery up there? I'm not entirely sure. I thought we had one in here too. Or maybe I'm just a massive, massive idiot. Um... I mean, that's, of course, we also know that that's the case. That's not a lie. Uh, I know that I am, but I really thought we had one in here. So, very close to this place. Yeah, there you go. A battery, an energy battery. Which is absolutely full. There's 60 hours of power stored in there. We don't need more than that. That's 60 hours is a lot. That's a lot of power that we can do with just a battery, mate. That should work out pretty fine. These things are still producing the barley. There's, these are still producing corn. The corn. And this one uh, is still producing the Xenosage and the uh, Antari. What was that noise? What was that? Did you hear that too? I don't get what that was. That was really, really strange. Uh, something that we want to do here, probably as well. Just, just for the sake of it. We're going to get one construction drone, like right next to this. Oh, it's this giant, massive ship. Look, where'd it go? To the beyond, mates! We'll see you later! Where's it gonna go? Can I follow it? No, I can't. This drone is now in uses, and we can actually get... What, the, what do you mean, no drones in range? Show the range of this. I mean that... Oh, come on. Are you bloody kidding me? Do you want to get some more far, some more greenhouses, maybe? And get some more uh, options here? So, at the moment, what are we making? Okay, these guys here are making barley. They're doing the barley. These guys are making the xenosage and the entire... We've got... So, we've got barley, barley and corn. Uh, we want to check out maybe availability for a melon farm. Melons are pretty good in this place. Like, we can build some proper melons in this area right here. So, we might just go ahead and place that one right here and build us some melons. That could work. There you go. We'll build some melons there. And we'll get some, uh, some things going on for us over here too. Uh, which is perfect. And then... Can we get another greenhouse in that can make, I don't know, broccoli? How is broccoli in this area? Broccoli isn't too good here. Is there any place we can actually make some decent broccoli? This is okay-ish for broccoli, I suppose. Like over here. It's 2.3, 7.4, 8.3. This is a decent broccoli amount. We're just going to build broccoli over there. Fine. We're just going to get loads of farms in. Uh, quinoa is something that we want to build too. A bit more of it. I mean, rice is rice, not quinoa. Uh, rice is pretty decent... Pretty decent over here, actually. We'll build a rice farm over there. And then we got okay, one more farm in the middle. 
Uh, what are we not building yet? Are we building corn? I think we are building corn. Quinoa. We'll build a quinoa farm. Even though it's not a lot, we'll build a quinoa farm right there. And then because of that, we also will build a... Uh, can we actually build a habitat? A habitat's here too? We can build that right here. So let us do that. So people can actually go and live there and do some things of their own. We still have plenty, plenty of... Uh, what are they called again? Nanites. So that shouldn't be a problem. Now we can also be able to pick this one up. We can. It's vodka. 200 vodka. Some quinoa and some nanites. Drones, go pick it up. I mean, they will probably do this when these are done. Like, none of these farms will probably work instantly, but holy crap, will we get will we get lots of fucking shit in here? Like, jeez. The capacity for the inventory. We could actually use a bit more of that. That's a good idea, actually. Let's how about we do that? Uh, I don't know where. Here here? I think it's right here. Chemical plants. No, that's storage depot. I mean, a storage depot over here would not be a bad thing for all of these fucking farmers who are just producing and producing and producing their butts off. So, they can go ahead and do that. We also have this bar and grill thing, a VR center, a hospital, which is not something that we can place here. A retail center doesn't fit here either. A park is too big. Um, God, we can also we can place another bar and grill, I suppose, in this area. Fine, whatever, we'll place another bar and grill. And then, just because for the sake of it, we'll, put, we'll get another intake fan in this area as well. Just, you know, to make sure that it keeps rolling. We've got another to spend on it, so why not do it, right? We'll go ahead and do that. So now we have two bars and grills. We've got one for this area. We've got one for this area, I suppose. Uh, another storage depot in which we can get some shit going on. The drones are all going back to what they were doing. The iron mine is still working. We still need more people in here. Like, holy crap, do we need more people in here? Uh, cargo pot has been required, and we got some more stuff, which is fantastic. This thing will go into bistro mode as well. Food quality is still marginal. It needs to be better. We need to up our food quality game. But overall, this place is pretty, pretty okay. It's a bit dark here all of a sudden. Is the sun gone? Where's the sun? Huh. Oh, we did it. Yay! Another thing completed. Back to the trade hub. Uh, trade hub. And now it's time to stop exporting. Oh, no. We still need to do the mine mold. Never mind. We did something else. I don't know what exactly it was that we did. Uh, we got another mission. The happiness of your colonists in mind as you grow your I try. Remember, we're all in this together. Yeah. Well, okay, 50% of them should be happy to do this. The referendum, um, I can do that. There's a 80% of them seems to be happy at the moment, so I can do that. Winter is coming. We're fine for water. We're extremely fine for food. It shouldn't be a single problem to actually do all of this. All of these uh, things are working right here. The greenhouses, look, all of them are producing, producing away. We've got food for days for basically everything. They can get whatever they freaking want, and it's awesome. Uh, just broccoli is something that might slowly be a little, little bit less of. Oh, this is the button for inventory. Ha ha ha! We're still exp exporting the mind mold. We've got plenty of. Let's make a consumable. Let's sell we. We're just gonna let them consume mind mold. Whatever. Everything else should be consumable. The ration packs, let's not make those consumable because those are in need. So, um, we'll, we'll, we'll unlock those as soon as we need them and we're in sort of trouble. Uh, but for now, I don't think it's necessary. Uh, everything else is consumable uh, if I'm in charge, which I am, so that's great. Colonists! The whole list of colonies, the morale. Who is the most unhappy person in this place? Oh, we can actually sort it. This person, Ryan Jordan. You, you don't seem to be very happy. Ryan Jordan, can I can I go to you somehow? Ryan Jordan. Is this where you are? In this building? Ryan Jordan? Ryan? Ryan, where are you? Why are you so unhappy? You sh are you happy? I think you're pretty happy. Is it good that I use mind mold? I don't know. 50% of the population is addicted to it now. Average health is really good. 22 of them are recovering from addiction. <laughs> is this bad? Am I doing a bad thing? Will they riot towards me now when I take it off the market again? Probably. I'm not sure if I've done the right thing here. I'm pretty scared now, to be honest. Oh, we did the mind mall thing. Great. So now we can go to the trade up and we can in import beer by exporting more barley. They probably really like the beer. Um, right. There's 80 people addicted now. 80 people are addicted. Uh, and I don't know whether this is good or not. <laughs> some thoughts on how to best expand your colony. Construct four additional buildings. That's so helpful. So great. What do I feel that it needs? It probably needs a bit of everything. I wouldn't know. It could do with a park. We could give him a nice park next to the hospital. That will be very nice. Or so I think I think so. Like a nice park next to the hospital. I don't think people will mind. I don't think people would actually mind that. This is not an option, so we'll just leave it at this. Because it doesn't make any sense for us to do. Uh, never mind. Don't do this. Uh, can we build behind here? We could. 
There's not a lot, but it's fine. We could build here. We could make, like, a residential zone over here. Like, it's probably supposed to be done, like, zoning out, but I've just placed everything everywhere. Like, it's an absolute mess. <laughs> probably a bad thing. But, you know, oh, we've got this Earth History Center. That is cool. That's really cool. Power-wise, is there any more geothermal generators anywhere? I think we've used all of them, haven't we? We have used all of them. Um, which is a bad thing in this, to say that that means that we cannot get any additional power anywhere from. We need to do it with solar power from now on. Uh, because we're using lots of power and we need to make sure that we know what we're using it on. So we might actually have to like get a bunch of solar panels in here or whatever. Uh, because if we don't get some more power in, we might eventually uh, get some cock up. So what we'll do is we'll build some solar panels on either side of this mine. And just construct those and see where it goes. We've got plenty of nanites. Look at this. We are making so many nanites. It's just literally ridiculous. But they're going to be building all of this. You could just like try to spread it out more. Not four in one building, but go and build. Yeah, exactly. Go and help each other out. Get some more of these in. So we get more power going, which is absolutely fantastic. These, of course, are now working on 50% because of the winter time. But in summer, we can get plenty of power via that. We need some more power anyway. Uh, so why not construct these, right? Uh, we did this. Awesome. This is a thing that happened. Great. And also this. And this. Objective. What is happening? Governor, during our initial Hi. exploration of Vanar, our scouts encountered an unusual alien life form. This organism oh. is only marginally intelligent, but it does pose a great danger to our colony as it can attach Fuck. to our buildings and grow very quickly. We call That's it not good. Ape. Our research team analyzed the threat and quickly devised a special drone that can cleanse the creep from infected structures. I'm now uploading the schematics for those scrubber drone stations directly to your colony governance system. I recommend okay. finding one as soon as possible. Our scanners have detected several creep spores heading toward the nearby lake, and an infestation oh, is God. highly likely in the near future. This lake? Are they coming to this lake? No! Creep spores, stay away from me! Don't, don't do it. Scrubber drone. Scrubber, scrubber, dubber drone. Uh, so we'll get one to scrub this area. And we'll also get one in this area to scrub this place. Uh, which we'll get over... Um, if I will get it over here. I think that's got everything now. Or do we want to get one over here too? I mean, I'm scared of these. Like, legitimately. So, fuck it. We might as well. We might as well get them everywhere. I'm afraid now. What are they going to be looking like? How bad are they going to be? Am I going to die? Oh no, they've been detected. Oh my god. What are those? These are disgusting. Huh. They're not very fast though. So that's good, I suppose. What do you want now? Oh, wow. This is pretty amazing. Vori, are you on? Jack, where are you? I'm studying the flora just outside the Vanar colony. I found a strain of plant that closely mimics Decadon verticillatus back on Earth. So while we're all slaving away on the colony ship, you've been off picking flowers? Uh, if by that you mean has the expedition's only qualified botanist and zoologist been doing his job, then yes. Yes, he has. Okay, what, what, what is this? Here, Euros. Let me send you a picture of this flower. Yes, what? I cannot wait to see this plant. It sounds amazing. Oh, man. You are gonna love this picture of my flower, Euros. It's got these two big, fat, pink petals on it. Jack, you just hoarded a picture of your butt to the entire colony ship. <laughs> I... wait, what? Jack, how what? many times do I have to remind you about the problem Get rid of them. for internal communications? What? No way, you gotta be... No! I meant to send that just to Euros. <laughs> Instant karma. That's it. I'm suspending what? the use of Twirtle until further notice. It was a completely innocent Twirtle? mistake. Twirtle? Really, I meant to scan the flower and Jesus. I must have pointed the scanner the wrong way. I'm also recommending immediate disciplinary action. Sorry about all this, Governor. Hang on. The fuck I'm is this shit? I'm offline while I delete that twirt. <laughs> what just happened? 
That doesn't make any sense to me whatsoever. Anyway, it's time for us to leave this episode right here. The Scrubber Jones have done their job in this sports. They weren't as scary as I thought they would be. They got rid of it. This colony is going very fast. Lots of food, lots of water, energy, air. It's all fine. Everyone's probably addicted by now, which is amazing. Uh, always a great thing to do and see. But for now, I'm going to leave it here. I hope you enjoyed it. And if you did, then make sure to leave a like and subscribe. The conversation about his butt. That, what the hell, man? <laughs> This game, this fucking game, it's really cool, even though it's still in better version, there's gonna be a lot edit that's just really, really cool, and I really enjoy this game. So, I hope you do too, again, if you did, make sure to leave a like down below, it's very important if you do, uh, it really helps us out, and if you haven't already, subscribe down below, as well, welcome to the family, I appreciate you being here, and then I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye!